Welcome to PC Wits Kids Tech Talk. It's been a while since I did an Ubuntu video, and Ubuntu Tweak 0.4.8 just came out. I used 0.2 a while back, and there's been many changes since then. So if you're new to Ubuntu and you want to tweak it, well, go to ubuntu-tweak.com, click on the download link, and follow these instructions here. You'll have to open up a terminal window, of course, and follow these steps to obtaining the source and installing it on your PC. But once you do these, it's pretty straightforward, right? Do these instructions based on the uh, version of Ubuntu that you have. And then once you execute it, it will install it similar to what you see here on my screen. And then it will say that it's done. Okay. And once it's done, it will appear in your menus on the top corner here under the uh, system tools. So when you launch it, it uh, basically has all kinds of neat options for you to tweak the, the your, your Ubuntu. Whether it's Ubuntu 8 or Ubuntu 9, it has support for that. It gives you the basics about your PC. It gives you the basics on installing programs all from one spot. Even third-party programs such as the new Firefox that's in development, 3.6. Uh, or maybe you wanted to get just an FTP program. Well, you can easily do everything all from one place instead of having to flip-flop and go into different um, places in Ubuntu or configuration files and edit and tweak things. If you're not comfortable with opening up a terminal window all the time or editing certain things uh, or cleaning, all of this can be done within Ubuntu Tweak. And I like that about it because it allows you to clean up orphan files, clean up the cache, clean up different areas and free up space. And you, you wouldn't necessarily be able to do that if you didn't know what you were doing. So this allows you to easily do that. And the program is free, by the way, as it should be. It's open source. And um, another thing that it does, which is pretty neat, is control what you can have starting up. So in your startup, you can uncheck things and have them removed from the startup. So the behavior, the time that things will take to load, obviously, can be changed by that. You can even tweak the uh, way the windows work, the transparency level as well, all from one spot. That, again, that's what I like about this utility. Very powerful, does all kinds of things. And uh, for those that are not familiar with uh, where to go to do certain types of things. Well, this has it all in one spot. Um, even tweaking your edges of the screen, for example, right? Uh, you've seen this on the Mac, and uh, you can now do it here in Ubuntu easily using Ubuntu Tweak. Just uh, select what each corner is going to do when you move your mouse to each corner, for example, and then the changes take effect immediately, right? After you do that, you just move your, cu your cursor to the corner, and uh, it invokes that uh, feature that you that you specified. So, I mean, little things like this make this utility very attractive uh, to use, right? Because it saves you time. That's the bottom line. So, um, definitely recommend this if you don't have it and you're running Ubuntu. Probably want to check this out. It's been proven. It's been out for a while, obviously. I've been using this since version 0 0.2. So, right now it's at 0 0.4.8, like I said. So, um, it's... Uh, grown in popularity since uh, since the beginning obviously and there's a lot of support and they keep adding more and more features to it so this is definitely uh, one of the top apps in my book for for Ubuntu if you don't have it already okay so check it out if you haven't and uh, comment if you do have this installed let me know what you think if you also have uh, had good um, experiences with it and share with uh, with everybody in your comments okay so I'd like to thank you for uh, watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.